back to Pebbles Rocks Rocks. Today we will be putting foam on my skim board. So here's my skim board. It's a Bellingham Board Co. skim board and here's my foam. You will be needing a skim board, sandpaper, rubbing alcohol, some pens to sketch out your design, scrap paper, scissors, Zacto knife, and foam. So what we did is we took some our scrap paper and um, we made it the same size, size as our foam piece so that we can basically just sketch out what we want. All right, so here's our design and we're gonna go ahead and cut it out. Now we're going to be tracing our thing onto the foam. wins the foam tracing competition. Oh my goodness. We're gonna go ahead and flip it over and trace it onto the other side. So this is the part where we get to line up our pieces. We have a really cool like tree-like piece and um, just set them where we want and then last we will be sanding it to make it rough and putting it down. So next we will be dashing um, some lines around it with our shirt. So we did the rubbing alcohol and it does take the Sharpie off so try to be careful of that. So we just finished this um, back foot pad and I'm really, I really like it. I think it looks really good in the tree. The diamonds kind of make it look more like pine cones. And we are going to move on to the bar here. We'll follow a similar pro process with um, using the paper to trace it and tracing on the back. Of the so here's our bar design and we're gonna cut it out. some use in it so I'm really excited to show you the final skimboard and the big reveal. Ta -da! I really like it. I like that this is kind of like an arrow when it points up to this funnel type thing at the end and I love this board. I'm stoked to write it and thanks to our sponsor Bellingham Board Co for providing the foam and the board. Go check them out. Go check their Instagram out. And um, I really hope you like my skin.